For those of you wondering, this would have been my pre-match meal today, along with a with a banana or two, um, and some game brain while I'm at it. This is just a bit of a whole grain pasta, some paprika or capsicum, um, carrots and tuna, onion, garlic. Pretty quick, easy to make. Just cut up some vegetables, fry the onion, fry the garlic, boil up the pasta. Yeah, you got a meal. Not playing today, but it's important to support the team as they walk out in the field now. Today's opponent is FC Ardau. Ardau is a professional club in Switzerland. They play in the second tier, and today we're playing their under 21s or the reserve side. Had a bad couple of games. Uh, we've lost the last three games, so now it's really time to get back on track because we have a great team and we're just losing on set pieces. Come on, 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 Oh, move! Oh! Let's get the one on one. Oh, oh. Can you do it? Oh. Hey! 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 Put the ball. Oh, oh. oh. Nein. All right, three one. Great win for us. Definitely the kind of win that we needed. <laughs> but it's raining. It. So just waiting for my train now. I think it's a good time to do some real talk with you guys. You know, summer's coming up and every summer is a chance to do something new, to bring change to your life. I mean, most of you know, I live in Zurich, Switzerland. I've been living here for the past year. I've got a great day job. I play semi-professionally. I'm running effective. It's great and I feel blessed and I feel fortunate. And I feel appreciative of, of doing all the things that I, I get to do. Now, for those of you who don't know, when I was 16, I decided I wanted to become a professional footballer despite having not many connections, uh, being average. Started blogging every step of the way, every week, what was happening, how I was progressing, and how I, how I, was, I was trying to become a professional footballer. Long, 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 long story short, with really hard work and persistence, just to name a few things. And long story short, I got a contract offer to play professionally in Hungary. And that proved to me that with hard work and dedication and discipline, you can achieve anything. That's all the kind of stuff that's taught in, in Train Effective. So fast forward, ever since that time, I've continued playing semi-professionally. I've got paid to play, which is great. Um, I'm working on business, have a girlfriend. Been earning a degree and living in Amsterdam and now Switzerland and, and traveling. It's been great. Now, despite still working really hard with football, and I'm still talking, putting in the extra work, to make it to a professional level, it's not enough. Being a professional footballer is more than the few hours of training you have each day um, and, and a game on the weekend. Much, much more than that. Being a top level athlete, your sport is your entire life, guys. Entire life. You're 24 hours a day eating right, it's about sleeping right, it's about every training, you're, you're mentally prepared, fully focused, you're ready, all your energy is focused towards full as your entire existence, it's, your, it's, it's what you're thinking about every hour, every minute of the day, you're thinking about football. If you watch any interview or documentary about any world-class athlete, you know, the Ronaldo movie, uh, NBA players, they tell you the same thing. Vardy quit his job working in a factory just so he could focus on becoming a full-time footballer. Jay Demerit, he didn't make it to the MLS, so he quit everything and he left to England just so he could pursue his dream. He left everything. That's why if you want to become a professional footballer, if you want to live your dream, if you want to become really successful at something, this has to be your life, this is everything for you. And that's what I'm learning guys, like you can't become 
professional footballer. You can't become a, a millionaire without really wanting it, without, without it. It's your soul. If you want it more than everyone else, and you match that by working harder than everyone else, and I mean really freaking hard, you will succeed. So that's why this upcoming summer for me is like, what do I want to become? What do I want to put everything into? I'm currently have to consider whether or not I continue working at that company. Which by the way, is also a cool job. Instead of putting eight hours of, of work into effective every day, do I now put 16 hours of work into effective every day and make it even, even better? Effective is doing well. Do you guys love it? I get great feedback all the time about it. <laughs> it's growing. I believe it can come huge. Or do I drop all of that and do I put everything, everything into become a professional footballer to get to the next, next level? Screenshot or comment what you think I should do. Should I do one, two, or three? Just to recap, guys, you have to put everything into achieving your dream. But once you make a choice and you put everything into it, you will succeed. But what that choice is for me, I don't know. But keep following this Snapchat, keep following Train Effectives to find out. Let's see.